Right now, we just have worships going on. Um, our Takoa family is here with us. Education is not just within the classroom. Education takes on every single day of life. That's why she said we, we never graduated from the school of pride. You bless them in all wisdom, in skill, in knowledge, in understanding. And Lord, I pray that you repay them because we cannot repay them for what they did. And Lord, I pray that you continue to be with us, help us to grow as a family. Ah, uh, Brother Miguel is washing his hands, preparing for lunch, right, Brother Miguel? Sir, I am so hungry. Yes. Oh, wow, wow. It's good to be hungry. <laughs> draw closer to you throughout all of this and we may remember all the things during the emotions and whatever that that will draw us closer to you to help us stay in our minds and to change us forever so bless them give the traveling races back to Tekoa and I pray that they may have a fantastic time the remaining of the time every student has different times you know that that when they're done in school that they will be used that they cannot be stopped and nothing will stop them. So bless them, guide them. This is my prayer in Jesus' name. Right now it's um, Sunday morning, <laughs> the day when uh, the hell session starts and there is no oil in the house, it ran out. Yeah, we thought the oil would have lasted a little longer but actually the oil ran out and take a look at the outside right now, look at what the outside looked like. We just unexpectedly got a lot, a lot of snow and um, the guests will be on their way today about 2 o'clock and there's no oil. So we're trying to get oil at this time. We're trying to get some oil at this time. I mean, so far we fill up a few small tanks. There's an oil truck to the top of the hill.
working on, but I think I can Now we are at the Western Depot, just collecting a few items in bulk for the sanitarium. Some brown rice, molasses, nuts, looking for whole grain oats at this time, and some other items. Okay, so we just finished having lunch. We're still doing some last minute finish touches while our guests are downstairs. the body to fully recover and fully heal then right now organic is one of the best things but then really uh, we are about to get the farm organized so that way we can be able to get nutrients nutrient dense foods from our garden and the, and the whole goal of the sanitarium is to be able to have at least most of our produce most of our produce fruits vegetables fresh from our garden grown high food density according to God's plan so I praise God for the steps that we it's about to take for his place to be established. All right, and that's coming from Monet, who was dealing with the oil tank today. He smells like gas, but, you know, we're working up late. I mean, we're, we're working it late, but it'll all be worth it at the end for the guests. Right Ezra was doing some electrical work today and a little so bit of everything, we'll consultations, right and... We'll we just finished ordering the food they for all the you. juicing and everything else for the guests. Every detail plays a part. Everything put into place adds up to the bigger picture. So if one thing is neglected, it'll, it'll show at the end. So we have to get up at early in the morning and wake the guests up at 6 tomorrow morning to start their day to start their detox to start their cleanse and this is the life we chose to live for our lord and savior alrighty what do we have here money right now we just got a lot of produce from uh, Valdor all organic produce we just uh, bought the liver we bought it last night and it's right here we have carrots lemons alright uh, all organic organic tree beans organic kale organic oranges yeah. Lettuce. What's the lemons spinach. for? What's the lemons for? The lemons are already gonna be drinking lemon water every morning. Um, about two cups of warm lemon water every morning. And also you'll be using it for the liver detox as well. Oh wow. Yes, yes. And what's the string beans for? The string beans we have um well someone here is uh suffering with uh, high glucose, so we're gonna be using the string beans to help to regulate the blood glucose. Alright. Yes. Praise the Lord. Alrighty, so here we are. My guys are doing the juicing this morning. We already got one set of juice down for the guests. And they are prepping for the afternoon meal for them, which is the second batch of juice. How's it going, Ezra? Doing very well. Uh, we have our champion here. Trying to get some fresh organic juices for the different health guests that are in for this session but it's been doing very well and the good thing is they have been enjoying the juices so it tastes delicious it's healthy and it brings health and energy uh, to the body that's right that's right there's those other batches there and we'll show you very quickly what's going on upstairs we're coming in we're coming in
This is our cousin. Hi, my name is Nia. From Ohio. And why are you here, Nia? Remember the first time you came, how much you weighed? Um, I was 304 pounds. And in two days now, since you've been here, well, you're actually in the third day, but two days from yesterday, how much weight you've lost? From uh, 300 and what? 304 pounds. 304 pounds? How much you lost? I lost six pounds. <laughs> wow. In two days? Amazing. Amazing. Praise the Lord. Look it's at that. It really is amazing. Yeah. I can't wait to lose that 25 pounds in the two weeks. All right, all right. It could be more. <laughs> Actually, we have right now over two feet of snow and we need to exercise the guests this morning. But that doesn't stop us from exercising the guests. Take a look at this. Rackle is in therapy, movement therapy. Okay, so what I want you to do now is you're going to go in the squatted position. Go down. Up. People coming behind us with bagfuls. Let's go. We're gonna get a rose plow because the man said who we called the man canceled on us. We our truck broke down so we can't put our plow on. So we couldn't get our road plow. So we gotta go wash clothes. Doing the session for the guests, the linens in town, but we have to climb all the way up. Come on, guys! Oh boy, it's tough. in with a walking stick but look at this now praise God from whom all blessings amen amen God is good God is good <laughs>
look at the dining room. We have been working hard walk. on this. Yeah, and and Sweetie, what, what are you trying to do right now? There's the table. <laughs> we, we didn't get that properly. What's that? I just moved the table. Wow, praise the Lord. Why are you moving the table? Plant based, plant based. Why are you moving the table? Because we're getting ready to do our cooking school for our guests. Wow, praise the Lord. And this morning, what, what type of breakfast you had this morning? We had a nice cuisine breakfast of, what was it, well seasoned tofu with plant based, fresh, homemade, high quality, highly dense waffles and pancakes. All made from scratch. All made from scratch. Amen. Praise At God. The eating kitchen. Amen. Right now we are doing the cooking class for our guests, but there's more yeah, happening behind the scenes. Because uh, you still have to cook, this because the beans will be dry still. You put the water in and you allow it to cook and the water is This is behind the scenes, working it in the kitchen, washing dishes, cooking lunch. Cutting veggies, making salads. 